Good afternoon. Good evening. Good morning. Welcome. We're just having a few drinks as a toast to what could be another great travel vlog. We've only got about a week, so not quite as long as we'd liked, but you know, it's been a busy year. So let's just try and make the most of it and uh, take you along for the journey with us. You're about to see some bullshit. Ooh, <laughs> we've got 11 hours on this flight, so press like before you even watch. <laughs> Bride is here as well, so shut up. Hi. This is gonna be a tough one, it's three in the morning, yeah? Oh, what a slog that was. Right then, first order of business. Let's go get a drink. No, guess again. Let's go get a taxi to the hotel. Right then, so we've just got to this uh, place, pretty much on the seafront in um, Santa Monica. But it's Venice, so shut up. The situation is there's two single like beds in here. There's a double bed and a queen size bed yeah. in there. So we're just really deciding who's getting the doubles and who's sleeping on the singles. We've got four knives. There was no straws, so we had knives <laughs> and no straws. One in LA. <laughs> you got to pick one. Shortest chooses oh. last year. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> Jake's is slightly bigger than yours. I love that one. That one's got an external door that leads into an alleyway as well. <laughs> Perfect. You'd have thought as consumers, LA would have welcomed us with open arms, but they didn't. Kelly and his little shifty eyes got us stopped at fucking. Was it customs when you're coming? Honestly, like it's been. Why do you look at the camera when you're talking to it, man? This is what got you in trouble. It's been a back. shit start, to be honest. I've not really enjoyed it. Did got chewed out by security. Taxi driver shouted at me. Oh, he shouted at oh, me. He shouted oh, at me. Oh, the taxi driver shouted at me. Morning, gang. It's 6 a.m. in Los Angeles. Me, Bridie, and Raz. Feeling good. We've had a good amount of sleep. And uh, we're gonna get coffee, as is tradition. Three white millennial lads going to Starbucks. So we're just out here, thugging on the corner, you know, Los Angeles, <laughs> South Central, how it do. Four lattes, <laughs> one iced. It's just how we do it around here. So we're in the hey, what up, boy? We're gonna get blood in. I blood me, hey, brother. Blood in, blood out. <laughs> hey, welcome to the club. You need to clean your teeth. Yeah, I've only just woke up, man. <laughs> Hello. Oh god, decent night's sleep, man. Yeah, do you know what? I slept great. I, uh, I fell asleep watching some bollocks. Gay porn? Ah, uh, heaven truly is a place on earth. You've heard me go on about a million times, but come on, come on. It's Mary's birthday and she's sat home in fucking Morley. <laughs> I'm a man of many pleasures in life and I'm very lucky to be able to have so many opportunities, but this is there's nothing there's words to describe how fucking nice and cool this is. This is the American dream that everyone goes on about. This is fucking amazing. If you guys ever want to have an experience, come down here early in the morning and just witness the beauty that is. What is this, Venice Beach? We love a bit of basketball. We don't have a basketball, so we're going to use my fake Louis Vuitton wallet. What is it? Almost. Almost. Try again. Well done, mate. Thank you. You get to keep it. Cheers. I've only gone and got myself a gear card. A Revolut card. Zoom right into the pin. Does she pin? There's something about this. I think it's because it's early in the morning and it's very quiet. But just looking at. Just looking at. <laughs> His new bird's not texting back for <laughs> half an hour. <laughs> right, so we're waiting for the taxi. A couple of minutes away, we're gonna go pick the RV up. But before then, boys, I've got you all a little gift. Oh, I know you. No, you haven't. I am. Beautiful. Way. No way. Oh. There's one each for us, boys. Oh, oh. Sorry, you're so kind. You're so, man. so man. thoughtful, man. I am just a thoughtful. Can I put mine on now? Take it. Wow, not only brilliant as a card, but brilliant as a plectrum. Everyone, we want to say a big thanks to the homies at Revolut for sponsoring this video and making our trip possible. If you don't know, Revolut is a financial super app, so you can get on the App Store or the Google Play Store if you're that way inclined, get it downloaded and see what all the fuss is about. 
You can easily top up your account in seconds in the app via bank transfer, using your card, or using Apple Pay and Google Pay. You can even personalize your card so it's uniquely yours in the app. We've got these metal ones, which are the best ones, because when you slam them down on the table when you're picking up a bill, it makes a really cool sound like this. You can use the Revolut Visa card in millions of places worldwide and it uses the real exchange rates so you always get a great deal abroad. There's free ATM withdrawals worldwide within your plan so that means we can get money out and tip all the lovely bartenders. What you can do with Revolut is send money all over the world at great rates with no hidden fees which we love to see and also if you've got a friend who's a Revolut customer as well you can immediately transfer them some funds in any of these countries here for free. One great thing that we love about Revolut is the rewards. They are great. You can save up to 30% on brands such as Nike, Adidas, and restaurants like Pete's Hut. So how do you get all these amazing things? Use the link in the description, download the Revolut app. There's nothing to lose because it's free, and they even give you a free 20 pound welcome bonus. Beautiful. But only if you use our link. Specifically ours, no one else's. Our link. It's ours in the description of the video. Get down there. Twenty bags straight into your account. Got, Boom! Literally, literally got no to lose. Look at this. <laughs> I'm not like, I'm not even joking. I've got twenty quid here. I don't even use cash. Twenty quid and a Revolut. Beautiful. It's been a bit of a random day in Los Angeles. We're in Orange County at the minute, and we are picking up. You guessed it. An RV. An RV. And this is a special one. So join us on this journey. And it's his first time. My first experience one of so, these, so I'm very much looking forward to this. And it's great to have you, mate. Forget Danny White. <laughs> Who? I went for the squirt. I thought I'll have a drink that's inspired by Bridie's mum, the squirt. Hey, man. Do you think hey, of that? What's, eh? what's that squirt you saying? Oh, mate. <laughs> I'm looking at this RV now. Like, we're literally just getting an orientation. And I'm going to show you it shortly. But this is great. Can we leave now? I want to go. Let's go. This is quite literally, I think we're all a little bit speechless as to how fucking good this is. This <laughs> is an RV. And we're going to show you all around it later in the video. But for now, what's the plan, Raz? <laughs> Let's get out of here. Are we there yet? Yeah. And we're on the road again! First time since Route 66. We are in an American RV. <laughs> We're gonna grab the essentials and that's why we've pulled up here. Being somewhere where it's warm all the time is just so good for your body. Like, I know Jake's morning because he's got a bad back, but that's because he's an old fucking man, innit? Brush young spring chickens like me and Kel. 
just being like everything just feels like it works better, like the ligaments, the muscles, the cock. <laughs> so how long have you been playing? About 10 seconds. Yeah? How's it going for you? I'm more of a rapper. I took your car and I'll take your wife. No problems, no issues. I'm not under any strife like you. <laughs> Razzie's a <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna show you around the vehicle that we've just picked up. It I'm is showing us around your hips and tits, you fat cunt. <laughs> <laughs> I give up. We're gonna oh. show you around the vehicle that's fucking lovely. <laughs> this is the best RV we've ever had. We're gonna show you around it. It's a pursuit by coachman. Pursue your dreams, pursue your ambitions in this 9.4 litre. Big old window, so you can see out there. <laughs> That's always handy, isn't it? Purpose built wheels, look at these. Yeah, nice. The purpose uh, is... The purpose is to go round. <laughs> <laughs> Loads of little compartments, this one's really good. <laughs> it's that TV! That's right, pit my RV. Let me do it again for slow. Oh, it's got DVD. Oh, sick, what DVDs you brought? Your mum's. You've got the nice stepper. American made, that's what we're all here for. American made, remember that? Um, <clears throat> outside plugs, so you want to charge your iPhone outside, you can do. What's under here? Is this the storage? This thing's got loads of storage. Yeah, that's where you put the a bit more storage for the old This ladder, stairway to heaven. <laughs> hey, look at that, come on. I'm only insured for a million pounds. Right, now he's gone. Big bump right back. This one takes unleaded. Good for the environment. No doors to the front, and there's your boy Ryan up there chilling. Ryan, are you going to show us the cockpit? Yeah, Ryan, jump! Let's go show you the cockpit. Yeah, you would. So this vehicle's actually a Ford F. Fuck you, that's what it sounds for, <coughs> whatever. Cruise control, automatic gearbox. This thing revs like your mother. Big old Android head unit, it's got CarPlay on there. This thing's really good, because like behind here, there's loose connections, and every time you go over a bump, it just loses connections, so that's good. Why is there loads of bed in there? Fuck, <laughs> it's my bed in. <laughs> bed in. These chairs are actually really good as well. The suspension on this thing is really shit. So luckily, there's like six inches of cushion there to help you absorb all the, all the bumps. So you got this nice table as well that retracts, just like Jake's big ass foreskin. Got these sun visors that literally do fuck all. Shall we move on? So this is the main living quarters, and as you can see, it's absolutely massive and it's massive for one reason because it's got this... your nose in it pardon because it's got your Excuse nose me? in it no because of this button right here oh yes the old rv shuttle. so the whole the whole vehicle is now contracting and it becomes essentially the size of the vehicle that we're kind of used to but with the pop out or slide out it's called it gives you so much extra space. I had to take a walk to the bathroom this morning. We uh, put the guitar over there the other day and then extended this and it crushed the guitar. So now it's always in drop D. Um, over here we got the sink. We always end up using the sink as like the bin. So no change here. We got my pencils, the less of that then the better. Microwave, oven. This is cool, nice big fridge. Literally, literally bigger than my fridge at home this. Whoa, that's a nice stock fridge to well be fair. Stocked in it. We've got all the essentials and then we got the waters and the pig skin in there. So it looks pretty good. You got storage up top. Um, I think I mentioned the microwave. Just really nice, really comfortable. This sofa here, again, it's like better than my sofa in my living room, which isn't hard. Thanks for buying us it though, Raz. I do appreciate that. And that is, oh, I'll tell you what, when you're really horny in a few days, right? And you kind of want to, you know, mm -hmm. smack someone about a little bit. Yes. You can look at this sexy net here which has some BDSM elements so if anyone needs a bit of time to themselves with the net in a few days just let us know and we'll all fuck off Jake but, I think you do with all your fucking DMs that you send in that's true Jake come in anyway, oh, coming from him coming from him and now we're in the bedroom. Now this is really nice. So this is kind of the Friday. What's this room called? This is the priest quarters. This is the priest quarters. So this is where the priest sleeps and does all of his priesty stuff. Biddings. Big old bed. Not like you. Something you can really lie down and relax on. I'm going to enjoy it tonight. There's a mirror there, so I can look at myself while I sleep and masturbate because I'm vain as fuck. And this is really nice. There's also a TV there, so I can watch some good old American porn whilst I sleep. Yeah. Yeah, that's a bit of But when you're in RV, boating, it's nice, isn't it? Right, you've seen where we sleep, you've seen where we eat, you've even seen where we shit. Now it's time for us to get on the road and bugger off 
We'll see you at the next destination. Goodbye. Right, some of you might have learned that I fucking hate doing shopping videos. But what we are gonna tell you is rapid fire, real quick. What you buy from Target? Oh, Cut that back, we're not buying that shit. It was me I'm all along in this faulty pedophile. We spent over 400 fucking dollars of two so, days worth so, of stuff. So there's like a bottle fee for like all the all the booze and stuff. There's right. there's 80 dollars worth of boxes in there. Fuck off. 80 dollars <laughs> on boxes. Yeah, but one of them was. What kind of fucking boxes did we get? Oh, See now, mate. Do these boxes cure cancer or something? <laughs> yeah. Fucking expensive. Right then, you've been waiting about six months to figure out what did we get from Target. So we're gonna rapid fire this right now. What did we get? Yeah, keep them going. Sweets. We got some old spice. We got some old spice. We got some chocolate. We got, got some sweets. Toilet, toilet roll. roll. Pringles. Move the Pringles down the production line. Come on. Come on. We got some red solo cups. Some red solo cups. Some more sour strips. His Halloween. So we've got big bumper pack of sweets. Are we up? We got more sweets. We got big M&Ms. Got some mints. We got pig skin to throw around. Hut. 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 Some more buckies. 80 quid's worth of boxes. More sweets, pillowcases for Bridie. Oh, some more boxes, cancer curing boxes. Guess what? We got a microwave in here, so we got some bu 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 butter popcorn. Bu 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 pencils, ten pack. We got pencils. We've what got are they? Red Bulls. Excellent. We've got a scrunchie. Thank God. We got some Gatorades for Razzy. Gator. We got these because we're going to do the Centurion this evening. Gator's got a bad back, so we got some Tiger Bar. What's this? Two energy drinks? Whoa! Canada won't be dry when I'm around there. Because I'm not because I'm wet, I'm making it wet. <laughs> Dr. Peppers for Bridie. These pillowcases are on floor. We got a case of coronas. We said we're doing Centurion, you dickhead. Corona for Corona. The waters to drink to stay hydrated. For Jake to do it, Centurion. Fog me, man. We got some Bud Lights for Raz. Bud Lights is on that diet. And What's last, the last thing? But not least. Definitely not least. We got ourselves. Some Budweiser. Budweiser. Fuck me, knackered. Make room for the Coronas. That's our main drink for this evening. Hoots. Hooters. He's a bit creepy. Like, I know that's we're sat in here, but it's like it's just a bit weird. Look at these. Right, it's 9 p.m. We're gonna drive for an hour and a half until we're at like. Where are we going? Oh my god, I'm trying to do the video and you're just walking away. Joshua Tree! I didn't say what we're listening to. I said where we're we going. Don't judge me when I get you in my car. Under the cord is all I can afford. It's not my fault that I spend my money. Undo. <laughs> right, resume. <laughs> no. You'll, you'll see. Right then, it's time to pick the beds. So, let me introduce the beds to you. You know the kind of format, but there's some new naming conventions for these. You've got God Suite, we all know about that. That's the one where God is down here. Now, it's not really the peasant suite that we're used to, so this is going to be called the Pennine Suite. Yeah, so this is it's kind of all right. Over here, you've got two bunk beds. 
One of them is going to be reserved just for our bags. Whatever one you want. That's going to be the peasant suite down there. And at the back, you'll obviously see there's a beautiful, I think it's bigger than a double bed, isn't it? That? Yeah, it's, it's a big bed. That's the priest's quarters. Yeah, and whatever you get up to in there is up to you, really, isn't it? I'm going to pick, um, not straws, because. Raz didn't tip the girl at Hooters, so he didn't get any straws. Um, <laughs> we're going to pick little bits of cardboard out of here and then decide who gets what. We all get one night in each bed. Oh. 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 <laughs> I always lose these. Ah. Oh, Ryan, so you choose first, right. which I'm glad actually, because you had a I one day of drama. I'm going to be honest. Which, which way are we rotating around? Where? Oh, so that's the peasant suite, yeah. yeah. No, no that's, that's, sorry, that's the Pennine Suite arbitrarily, it, that's now called the Pennine yeah. Suite. It goes clockwise. No, but it used to go peasant to God, and the point of that no, was it went, one night oh, you're yeah, a peasant, right. next year the oh, Pennine Suite will be outside. Alright, oh. cool. I'll have the priest's quarters. That's fine. Unfortunately, you picked the sorry straw. So. Fine, I'll do it. He might have to edit it out, <laughs> but we'll get there. Well done. Let's do it. Thanks for driving yeah, us Yeah, thanks here. for yeah, driving, Raz. Let's have a big hug. Come on, everybody get in. Including you. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Right. Look how much room we've got. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna play Centurion now, so. Oh, Watch me get fucked up. We're about to do, for better or worse, it's for worse, spoiler alert, the Centurion Challenge. Now, it's been a hot minute since we've done one of these. Really? Um, well, last time and we did one on Route 66, and every one of us was sick, so thankfully, if we're sick this evening, we got to just deal with it for the rest of the trip. Yeah. Right. Um, we have also been made aware that there's a brilliant new song from the Arctic Monkeys. It's I called Sculptures of Anything Goes. So the album just released today and we haven't listened yet, but we're going to put it on and have a listen. Yeah, so here we can. Maybe on a time lapse, eh? Listen so we don't to get it. copyright stricken. Oh man, shut the fuck up. Right, yeah, it was good that. I enjoyed it. <laughs> really good. Stop that. That's enough of that. I think it's pretty shot. Stop that. Tough that that, isn't it? We've given up on doing the Centurion conventionally because it's fucking horrible. So instead, he is some uh, only fans content. I have to be a quitter because I've never quit an auto in my life. Do I have to be? Yeah, you have to drive us. Yes. What car is this? Because I'm it. pretty good with cars. I've never seen one of them. We just want to sit here and watch this. Right, Dan is on four. Video, so we'll this is the Dan I grew up with. And he's amazing. Priest, the children's mother will be back in 10 minutes. So be quick. Oh, just a second. There's someone at the door. Hello? Hi. I'm really poor. Look at my shoes. I'm a pauper. I've, I've just shagged this fuck called Mary. And now she's saying that she's going to have a fucking child. Can I come in, please? Any room for a pauper in the well, I mean, converse? Seeing as this the house of God, of course. Oh, no. Please, come on. It is... <laughs> Let me in. <laughs> please. Come in. <laughs> Um, priest! Um, priest! Th there is somebody here to see you! What? There is somebody here to see you! One second. <laughs> what do you think your about this? Fuck, man. Oh, is that Budweiser? Child. Child. <laughs> <laughs> what brings you into our V this evening? Oh, oh my god, you pauper! I know, I just had some shitty converse on that I've kicked. Back out there. <laughs> oh, well, I've some about 20 yards over there. You're making progress. Yes. What do you seek this evening? Just a wee bit of shelter, please. Just some shelter. Oh, well, I'm afraid before you help yourself to our... <laughs> holy water, To our it? holy water. Yes, I thought so. Not everything in this life is free. What do you have to... Is that an AirPod? These are AirPods. Oh my yeah, god, look how long the stem is! <laughs> He's a pauper, it's not the AirPod Pro! I am a pauper. Well, Jesus! 
Oh. That's not Jesus, that's my friend Jake Varley on camera oh. C. I thought it was We've Ryan. We've got three camera sets I up this time. I thought it was time. Ryan Dunn. <laughs> I think they're all recording, yes, absolutely. <laughs> nice. What do you need, sir? I'm just somewhere to, somewhere to stay for the night. Is this the house of God or is it not? It Provide is, me with some shelter, please. You must please. first you can see bestow, I'm a <laughs> bestow yourself upon to the Lord okay. and confess your... Now, oh, sir, confession. I am not, I okay, am not the Lord. A confession. You are far too old for me. I'm a Catholic. Oh, okay, sorry. Sorry, sir. So it's a confession. Take your holy water and seek forgiveness from the Great One. Okay, this is this is one you may find hard to forgive me for, priest. Come forth oh, to the one and only. Oh, oh who is this dementor seeming figure under here? Hello, Lord. Oh, it smells bad up here. <laughs> Jesus. That would be you, Papa. Is it not his breath? <laughs> Did you not make the Lord use the mouthwash provided? Oh, Lord, forgive me, Father, for I have sinned and I come seeking a confession. Trying to lift that up a bit early there, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> lift it up. Lift it up my ears. <laughs> Lift it now. <laughs> do I hear? Do I hear? The Lord! Do I hear? Does he always take this long? <laughs> Child, rid him with sin. <laughs> and syphilis. That's your fault. What is syphilis? I've never heard of that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the Lord wants Levi's. <laughs> Pass it on. <laughs> Hashtag living Levi's. The, the Hashtag living Levi. <laughs> the Lord has risen. Oh, the Lord. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yes. Come, come um, child. Come with me. We oh, he was saying that in the back a minute. <laughs> Behind closed doors of the church, and none of your parents. Was this like the other pop out? <laughs> yes, indeed, yes. That's very nice. Thank you. I seek refuge, your Lord. Please. Yes, sir. Uh, the priest has asked for a sin, and I have a confession. No, to please. I, 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 I will hear it. Okay. It involves you a little bit this way. <laughs> Everything involves the Lord. The Lord yes, is the, the Lord is all seeing. As the Lord that's all seeing, I think you know this one. <laughs> the, Lord, um, the, Lord, the Lord knows. The Lord. I bet you do. <laughs> it was not a few months ago. Castro, my Bakuza download. And one night, I came out of the, the newly disabled accessible doghouse and I saw a young girl in distress. <laughs> this young girl needed some attention from a male. And she wasn't getting that attention, not at all, and she was in a lot of distress. So I told her to go back in there and get the attention. But the male had a partner at that time. And I persuaded this young female to start grinding on the male. I then saw another female, one that you're closely with, associated with. And she was best friends with the other female involved. And I said, shut your fucking mouth, you bitch. <laughs> Whatever you witness tonight, you will not pass on to your friends. <laughs> and I tried my best, old priest, to shack you up with another fair lady. Uh, uh, but it uh, went uh, horribly, uh, it uh, went uh, horribly uh, wrong. If the Lord could interrupt, you, you said, do you know what you're going to do tonight? You're, you're going to keep your mouth fucking shut, is what you said, child. I'd had a few drinks, forgive me, Lord, for using the foul language. May I interject? It's incredibly convoluted. I don't fully understand. Could you perfect? Yes, the Lord will explain. The Lord will explain. The Lord will explain. <laughs> the child tried to commit... Make, make, make the priest commit adultery. I did. Me? Yes. You tried to shack you up with... With, 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 with another... You tried to hook me up with someone at download. <laughs> we came out the doghouse. That's why! <laughs> <laughs> Forgive me, Father, for I have mm, sinned. Yes. Although... Incredibly if you knew, hilarious. If you knew how much fucking asshole you've caused me. <laughs> if you knew how much an asshole that caused me, I'm gonna wring your fucking neck. Do you forgive me? <laughs> Although incredibly hilarious, yes, it is. You are forgiven, young Thank child. You. Thank you.
Where did he get that curtain tie from? <laughs> <laughs> it was sent to the holy post office box address here. <laughs> well, it's nice to have the confession. <laughs> <laughs> Right, let me, let me get my fucking shoes. Oh my god. Just look at this place, man. This is. This is <laughs> incredible. It's a cold morning. I can see Bridie and Jake over in the distance having a room. Oh, Bridie's here. Morning. This is beautiful. So, this is Joshua Tree, one of the most regarded, highly regarded places in the world, I guess. This is lovely. This is stunning, mate. What a lovely place. Really, really nice. All it's missing is a nice big latte. Ooh, McDonald's. That's <laughs> maybe not, by McDonald's. Maybe not a Mackey's. It was saying over there, that it's been formed by, um, like, magma. It then forms on stacks, and as the water goes through, um, it, like, cracks them, and then it, like, erodes the top ones. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm I'm actually to the point of like speechless. I don't think I've ever seen something so beautiful places I've ever been in my entire fucking life. Do you reckon there's like snakes and stuff out here? There's I think there's like aliens and stuff, mate. Fuck off. Honestly. Aliens. Yeah. Fucking hell, there's one here. Morning. Welcome to Joshua Tree National Park. <laughs> Look at the fluffing in belly button. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is nice. It's time for the shower. I'm the first man to use it actually, so I'll be the uh, guinea pig. I've stayed in hotels with less spacious bathrooms than this. I cannot believe this is a fucking automobile. Ha 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 ha! Ho ho ho! Seen a spastic in the motorhome, much bigger than his own van. And when I saw him putting a mattress in the back of that, I thought this lad is a fucking tramp. He is ginger, and you know he's got the blackheads, and the teeth are quite crooked. But yes, he's paid to have them straightened, so it's fine. Thank you, everybody. What are you doing, Raz? Hurt yourself, you bastard. Well, you know what? It is beautifully peaceful out here. Um, in the middle of Joshua Tree. That's all I know. Because that's all that my data can tell me. There goes the first car that I've heard in about an hour. And it is mad that, like, that whole rock formation just there is, like, just there. Like, I kind of get why people believe in aliens. Because, like, who the fuck's put that there? Razzy's tea. Are yellow and green and it's something that I wish I'd never seen. Absolutely stunning. Oh, I don't like that. Stand on it. No, it's just a little cockroach or something. Oh, I don't like that, man. If that's, that's scaring you, then you're in the wrong place here, mate. That's foreign to me and I don't Whoa, like it. racist. <laughs> you don't know where it comes from. It shakes a bit weird, look. It wouldn't be a trip across California in the RV if there wasn't at least a little bit of piss and shit on the floor, eh? I give him the front seat and what's he doing? On Instagram, sending big paragraphs to Bird, innit? Right then, bitches, it's the four brothers. Who wants a Corona? Yes, um, please. Yeah, I'll have another one. Oh, shit. Oh, actually, can I have a Budweiser? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do you want 
Yeah. So on our route to wherever the fuck it is we're going, because I'm not yeah. quite sure, we're stopping off for some breakfast because it's easy to forget. This is something that we always do when we're in the RV, partially because of the jet lag, I guess. We wake up at like six in the morning. That's great. And then it feels like you've had a full day and you look at the clock and it's like 11 a.m. It's great. Get your money's worth. Good news. It's not even 11 a.m. It's 10 past 10. Excellent. So this is somewhere that I've been looking forward to coming back to ever since we were last here in April when we went to Coachella. It's IHOP because I love breakfast. And this is... And you love hopping into girls' DMs with massive paragraphs. Right, I'm off to message someone. So according to this app that I've literally just Googled, one of the first stops here is Victorville. Which is... You're looking at a full map of the United States there, though, so that's probably quite far away. There's a gun range on that route. Absolutely. Because I really want to shoot you in the face. Happy to do that. Yeah. Is that what we're doing then? Yeah, that makes sense. Because we, we, we kind of got to go that way anyway. Cool. All in agreement? Yeah. yeah. Just two of us. Can you tell your bird to calm down? He can't even barely play that. Honestly, me and Vals, right, we've tried to play songs together before and he just don't fucking know barely any songs, but he stood there it's posing with guitar. Like a plastic person, isn't he? There? He is. Is that Keemstar down there? <laughs> I think it is. Killer. Killer Keemstar. What a beautiful place, man. <sighs> this is fucking mad, isn't it? This is stunning, This is what living is this, for. This is the America that I love. This is truly heaven on earth right here. There is something so cool about just being in the middle of fucking nowhere. I'm surrounded by literally what can only be defined as wilderness. Just the, you know, like they refer to in films as like the Wild West. This is literally like the fucking Wild West. Look at this. This is so nice. They're off walking. Like, just in the middle of nowhere. It is so peaceful. And what the fuck is that on my arm? What the fuck is that? I don't like that. I really don't like that. Oh my god, it's sucking my blood. Oh, fuck. There's mozzies out here. Where the fuck is that cunt? Get that dead as fuck. Something that's happened at a really unfortunate time on this trip is the fact I've popped my back out. So... I'm in a lot of pain at the minute, but thankfully the one good thing about this RV is the fact that there is like the back bedroom, so I've come in here just to basically try to stretch it out, because I genuinely feel like an old man here. Me and Rob like snacks, we like drinks and snacks, uh, but we're going to make sure we have something different every time, but we do get like one cheat drink, one cheat snack, and this is my cheat snack. I love the barbecue crisps, so this is the party size, so I'll just have this one cheat snack and then I'll have different things next time. There was a train, big train at front, just one. Look how long this is, like my cock. Oh my God, it is ugly and rusted as well. And is it headed straight into an underage lass? If you want to do the mad cock thing, mate, you got to be ready to clap back like your mum's cheeks. Look at that, there's two different kinds of men. Men who will drink their coffee and men who nurse it. We've got a nice straight road ahead. And there's only one thing you can do in a big old bus like this whenever you've got an open road. And that's do a 0 to 60. So oh. let's do that right now. Hold it on. Three, two, one, go! Oh shit, okay. 15, 20. Buffeting! 30! 40! So we're ready to stop. 50! Where is it? 60 on. You ready? Ready? Stop! Oh. Emergency brake! Ah. My beer has fallen all over the seat. <laughs> uh, 22 seconds. <laughs> 0.35. 
So we are on Route 66. So it's only right that we do some Route 66 style shit, innit? Welcome to some abandoned shit hole. Now I know what you're thinking. Rob, didn't you used to live there in 2018? And the answer is kind of, yeah I did. Well, that was a bit different. Are you sure, Johnny? I'm not sure it's good for the kids. I think it'll be great for the kids. Look at all the playground they have right here. But it looks a bit... I'm not really comfortable with this, Johnny. Uh, give it 10 years and this place will be the new Las Vegas. I think we put ourselves a little uh, pool over here. Over here. I got a question, Johnny. Are you meant to be from the hood or from like the redneck area? Because it's a little bit ambiguous right now. I'm a bit of both. Ah, <laughs> oh, swing I'm both ways. I thought hood. Danny White wasn't here. Guess it's not going then. So we were following the Route 66 just for a bit. There's something to do, uh, but this road's closed, and I can't be asked figuring out how long it'll take to get around and to fuck about. So we're just gonna get on the freeway and drive straight to Vegas. How far is that? It is two hours, 42 minutes. So we're gonna get there about half six. Lovely. Something that always makes me very anxious is having a piss on the road like I'm doing now. Cause I have no idea what's going on out there. If we get into a fucking pile of I'm gonna die with my pants around my ankles. We are officially crossing to Nevada. We would have got a shot of the sign, but Barley was too busy trying to message a bird as always. Now he's, now he's trying to get a shot, but he should have been doing that. And you almost thought we'd go in a, on an incidental. A what? What's an incidental? What the fuck's an incidental? Right. And you thought we'd go on an intercontinental trip without visiting one of these. That was really efficient. Well done, everyone. Maybe it took 10 minutes. It's pretty good for us. gang we've arrived and um, I forgot just how fucking sick Las Vegas is you know a lot of people this weekend for this festival that we're going to have, have flown straight to Vegas which probably makes the most sense if you come in next year to when we were young try and try and fly into Los Angeles and drive because it's fucking stunning and it's probably gonna be more memorable than the actual event so make sure you do that as my top tip it's probably cheaper to fly to LAX anyway so Anyway, just uh, finishing my piss. Are you filming? Yeah. Is that alright? We've ar <laughs> Hmm? Is that alright? Is what alright? For me filming? Leave the fucking cheek and attitude at home, mate, otherwise we'll drive you straight back fucking home. I don't wanna go home. Welcome to Vegas. I can't drive anyway. Welcome to Las Vegas. Great to have you, Jay. Thank you. You're gonna have a riot this evening. Do just plugging in the recreational vehicle. We got a nice little setup for some drinks. Everyone's gonna have a shower, we're gonna freshen up, and then we're gonna go and probably buy the city. Oh, that's on that one. It's just eat. There's an Ethernet. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, what? Ethernet on there. <laughs> Brian was trying to plug the RV into the Ethernet instead of the power. <laughs> Show him the Ethernet port. I wasn't trying to plug it into it. Yes, you were. Because right. I said it. Let's deposit my shower gel on here. Thanks for that, Miles. Now we're going to have a nice shower. First nice shower of the trip, actually. So let's do it. Let's get fresh for Las Vegas. Oh, really nice, that. Really, really good. And it's cool that they've got like little warnings as well, little kind of little guidelines for the for the campsite while you have a shower. So, for example, you know, we can't clean the facility after each use. Like, absolutely. I don't expect you to, but thanks for letting me know. And of course, remember, drinking alcoholic beverages during pregnancy can cause birth defects. No, I didn't get my body in. Did you get any hair in? No, not yet. So if we don't get lucky on the slots, <laughs> we might get, <laughs> might get lucky elsewhere. On a different kind of slot. Do you like the uh, the big tits, small tits, <laughs> big bum? Spare you the details because it's not really appropriate. But um, 
me and MB are about to go and put a really big bet on. And there's a bit, bit of nerves and a bit of anxiety. We're betting the channel. And if we, if <laughs> we the channel has, we're betting it. And if we win, we're not doing that. But if we win, then it's we win, and that's time, good. And it? if we lose, it's still going to be a good time. Good so we're going to go to Caesar's Palace and <laughs> make a big mistake. I'm pretty nervous, not going to lie. A bit edgy. It's a little bit on an edge. We've got the money. It cost us $120 to get the money. Now to get my own money. Get my own money. <laughs> Guess what? We did it. We all won. Every one of us put a substantial bet on and we all won. And what a great experience. And we won and we left straight away, which is really hard to do. But Bridie knew that the night was good. Let's get the fuck out of there. And uh, yeah, so we're all rich now. You're not so sure. we'll, we'll see on the other side. Closing the doors, we shut it down. <laughs> right, boys, we waited a long time for these. This is it. Many, this many is, years. This is what really starts the night off. We're in Fuel Bar, we've got the painkillers. The night's about to get real messy. Jake will have a couple more buttons undone. The good thing is, there is no painting. We're all winners here. So I guess this is just like taking prescription drugs. <laughs> <laughs> you know what is hard though? Can you promise me something else? Yeah. Do not give me access to that dollars until we get back to the app. No problem. Okay? No problem. Do not do not give me access to No worries. I be saying to you. Yeah, I know, don't I'm worry. Yeah. Do don't worry. Sit rep, we're having a fucking great time, of course. It's Las Vegas. Why would we not be? What is that? Double vodka red bull. Seventy six dollars. I feel like what we are what we're good at is coming to Las Vegas and getting drunk. What we're not very good at is explaining what's going on. So I'm gonna take a second, step out of the madness, just to explain what's happening. So we're in a place where three months free. If you're coming to Las Vegas and you watch this channel, I guarantee you you're gonna enjoy three months free. It's like the crazy cheap like dive in Las Vegas. We're in here buying one pound drinks so we can keep all our money. But they've got a live cover band on, it's great, have a look. She go to White Castle. Too early for food. White Castle. Too early for food. If you stay here, I'll go back a bit more. Right. I'm gonna go have a bit of a gamble. You stay here. Yeah. Oh, here he is. There he is. How, how, how did your gambling go, mate? I've been liberated of twenty-five dollars. Yeah. I've just, I've just got a new energy. There's been some, uh, you know, I'm just really happy. I'm really happy, man. And it's not because of the casino winning, because I'd be just as happy if I lost. I'm just happy properly for the first time in a hot minute and I'm manifesting it as arrogance and I'm allowed to. Rob's too fucked because he's feeling warm and bright. It's so, so happy. Friday night. Yeah, I am happy. Because it knows we're right. Let's sing a pale wave song. <laughs> we're going to get two number sevens, which is 20 sliders, four soft drinks, four fresh french fries. That's about 6,000 calories. Are you all right with the calorie count? Get out, mate. I ain't calorie counting. Yeah, we can tell. The only thing I'm counting is birds' numbers. I've got none so far. The most depressing order in the world. Right, boys, dig in. Dig into. Dig into mediocrity. No, I've literally got a really bad back. Yeah? No, oh, honestly, come on. I, I, I know, so I, we're wasting time here, so come on, I, keep mate, walking. I'd give you a piggyback any day of the week, just not to do Come here then, boys. Let's uh, no, I don't like that. very ill and there is only one cure for this illness and that is to open up your heart oh, no. and seek the higher light oh yes father please introduce me to the higher light <laughs> higher light I have someone here that is wanting to speak to you and is asking for some form of forgiveness Please, Father, I'm ill. 
I am ready. Oh, Father! Oh, yes. Heavenly Father, peace be upon him! Mashallah, brother. What is it you need? I'm gravely ill, Father. You look it. Thank you. May I prescribe an ophthalmologist and a dentist to you, boy? Father, the problems I have vastly outweigh the qualifications of those We heard about them last night. Yes. Father, I am ill. Let me know what I must do. You need to confess a sin oh. to us. One that we can send to the angels. Please, give us a oh. sin. Okay, Father, I've got a sin, but I'm not proud of it. You better be good. <laughs> Pardon? <laughs> you better be good. What do you mean you better be good? Uh, better be a good one. <laughs> okay, Father, I've got a sin for you. And what is the charge? <laughs> a succulent Chinese meal. <laughs> Eating deal. a meal? <laughs> a succulent Chinese oh, Father, on. it was the lockdown. Oh, yes, lockdown. Many of us remember the pandemic. The pandemic. Yes, I Some remember. Some would call it the pandemic. I remember that. Not me. I've had two vaccinations. Not your booster, though. Sir, I was Man. bored. Sir, I had nothing to do with my time. What did you do? <laughs> Tell us, what did you do? All I wanted to do was be entertained. How did you entertain yourself? Tell us. <sighs> I thought, what better way to entertain myself than with it? The PlayStation 4 for the gamers. I it's knew. for the gamers. I knew he did this. I knew he did it. I knew. He was never a dolphin. He was always a shark. And Tell I, us. And I thought, well, I'll try out the new Grand Theft Auto 5, downloadable content, the Cayo Perico. Yes, it was a very good DLC. It was a fond DLC, and I introduced an entire new island to the to the man for the first time in almost seven years. And how did you afford the submarine? Tell us, how did you afford it? I bought it with in-game currency, sir. He's a sharky, I know it. Then, it turns out... He's a sharky. The submarine was not enough. How much did you spend? And I needed... I needed to buy an office. How much? And that is why I must confess to you, God! My deepest shame! For I too am bisexual! <laughs> 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 Only joking! But on that day, when I heard Dr. Dre was involved in the downloadable content, I had to buy the shark card! How much? I had to transact the £12.99 shark card! It wasn't twelve ninety nine, was it? How much did you actually spend of the Patreon it was, money? It was fourteen ninety nine. Thanks for supporting the channel with your Patreon money. It goes to what? It was fourteen ninety nine. My child. Well, I'm not bisexual either. My child, it's two a.m. and we're on a very packed caravan site in Las Vegas. Please be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> and also in America, and uh, shouting statements like that might get you. What did, I, what did I say? What is the charge? Eating a meal. You've dropped a full beer down there now. <laughs> oh Lord, I'm sorry. And um, what do you need to ask of me? I don't need to ask you one thing. You can be bisexual and still. Be I'm not. Bi I'm definitely not. Some of the women that you do entertain do almost look like they could venture across onto the other <laughs> batting team. But not anymore. Okay. For I have one question for you. Ask me it. It gives me no pleasure to ask, Father. How much did you win today on the roulette? How and will you forgive you me dollars? for my sins? I mean dollars, not euros. <laughs> Most importantly, will you forgive an old man, a foolish old man, for buying a card of the sharks? It had Dr. Dre on the downloadable content. As a man who's never bought a shark card himself. Oh, come on, God. I find it hard to forgive, but... Oh, God! You are forgiven. <laughs> oh, thank you, God. What it do, what it is. It is what it is, homie. How it be, motherfucker? Thousand dollar club, motherfucker. I'm <laughs> sorry about it. Stop pursuing the... F Good morning. Very, very successful evening yesterday. Though not completely imperfect. It was pretty good. Me and Raz just going for a shower. 
the Lord has blessed me with um, energy today. It knows that we've got a lot of work to do when we were young um, and he's completely just removed a hangover. He knows we're going to get that million views again <laughs> and that'll be really funny if we don't and I've said that but I think we might so. Right then gang so as you know we're off to when we were young which is going to be its own like big vid so this is going to be a bit of a random day today. We just left you with the confessions last night and you're probably just going to resume with some more confessions for tonight. If, if that's not yeah, right. you, why not? The, the whole of this day is going to be in that when we were young video. Uh, something I'm just doing, I'm just swapping out my phone case for this one. Um, and my mate Sam bought us this as a collective for hitting 100,000 subscribers. Uh, the world's greatest photographer. You might know him from uh, shooting some of our Piccadilly stuff along with a lot of other things. I just want to say this has really come in handy. I've used it at Boomtown, I've used it, I'm going to use it here and really appreciate you, Sam, you're a legend. So we'll slide this on and then get the fuck out of here, boys, eh? Good morning. Oh, Sorry. Good morning and welcome oh, to yeah. sunny Las Vegas, Nevada. We have traveled five and a half thousand miles to show you what When We Were Young Festival is really like. So, no, that's good. Oh, so rude. No, that's good. Let's go. I was, I was we've seen a lot of stuff go. It's been, we've seen a lot of stuff being said about this festival, and we just want to find out: is it all true? Do that again. Still doing the festival. And Matty Bride is here as well, so you can all shut up. Hi. <laughs> Cancelled. That is fucking ridiculous. What a shit show. We, we bought our tickets on StubHub, which is a fan race that we sell out of the Apple Store. So, what we're doing, we're going to try and extend the RV stay for one more night in Vegas. We're going to try and cram the Grand Canyon into today, which was what we were going to do yesterday. I'm going to try and cobble together some clicks on a video about when we were young being cancelled. We've had to move things around, obviously, because as you found out, today's festival got cancelled. Um, so we've extended the stay here for another day, so we're due to leave um, tomorrow morning. Monday we'll morning. Now, oh, yeah. We'll now leave on Monday morning. Um, and we've kind of just switched today's plans around. Today we're going to go and drive to the Grand Canyon now, which yeah. probably in all took about seven hours to get out there, to come back, to do whatever we want to do. And then tonight we'll get fucked up again. That's what I'd like to do. I don't Rob, know. do you want more, eight more painkillers? Not for me, mate. Why not? No, I've had my way with the city and now I'm here for fear. Oh, you're going to go to God? Yep. Okay. Come on out tonight, mate. You, you, missed, you missed a bit at the top, mate. Yep, I'll uh, get one of your exes to get up there and do that bit for me. So we're rolling through Nevada, I guess. Well, nice. It's turned red now. So in California, it was all like sandy colour. In Nevada, it's a bit more red. And I like it. We got some bangers on the stereo. And we might be going to a festival tomorrow. I'm not sure. It all depends on if it's going to get cancelled. So the vibes are good, hopeful, and a little anxious, but all good mainly. <laughs> I feel a bit suspicious holding this, you know. You have to keep play, it around. play it while your hands are moving on the thing. I think I could get good at this, you know. You're not, You're not allowed to drive to Grand Canyon, apparently. This might be the biggest robbery since that guy sold us those four plus Malone tickets. We saw the first ever tout. We immediately went up to him, $100. And we got some standing tickets, I presume. Four tickets, come on me. Four, four tickets standing for tickets. Beans. To the this guy. To see Push. Because we can general admission, 
I have to get a fucking bus there. To get school bus Do they not know we want to get back to Las Vegas? You know what, if you go to Vegas, you need to go to Fuel. We'll put on like the little Google Maps thing where you need to go. It's so good. They do this thing, the painkiller it's called. Best drink ever, it gets you wrecked real quick. It's bare fucking shit here. It's bigger than I thought. It's like, you come here and you have to pay a loads of extra so they proper gatekeep the view. Even to the point where like, this, this why, why is that a glass wall? If you're then just gonna put like the blocker yeah, things on it, so they have to. Yeah, so we were it. so we were in a gift shop, yeah, and then we paid fifty quid to get on a bus, fifty five dollars each, yeah. to oh, yeah. get on a bus to come to a, another gift shop, and then we're like, well, maybe we could get a coffee and like make it slightly better. Guess what's with the coffee? Closed. Yep. So but shall we go watch the last bit? Should we go watch all the American rejects for free? Yeah, go on. Then. I've never seen such an overly commercial load of bollocks in my fucking life. This thing, you should be able to drive right up to it, in your van, have a couple of beers with your mates, and just look out over it. This is obscene. Do not come to Crown Canyon West. Save your time. I wake up at four in the morning. I can't believe you called my phone again. I'm going out of my head thinking of you. How could you do all this to me? I feel free, finally. I feel better than ever, I'm never gonna call you back, no, never. Welcome to the O2 Messaging Service. The person you are calling is unable to take your call. Folks, it seems history once again repeats itself. Some heroes from Yorkshire have decided to step in and save the evening, and I don't mean us. It's the boys that bring me the horizon. They're gonna be playing a two and a half thousand capacity show, and it's just been announced that the tickets are about to go on sale. So we're gonna try our hardest to get some. We've been pretty lucky so far this year, so fingers crossed. We got him! We got him! So we just got the fucking bring me the horizon tickets. Cheers, Razzy. Went on Razzy's card. Cheers, that was 45 minutes of staring at that fucking phone Yeah, there it is, a notification. Trying to get those. So, and we got standing as well. So well done, boys. Um, oh, good work, good lord, that was a killer. I need a breather after that, I'm off for a piss. Just want to tell you about something pretty cool. Tonight is October 22nd, 22nd 2022, and just last minute, we picked up some tickets to see Bring Me The Horizon in Vegas. I'm sat in the RV, Bride is driving, we've got Jake up front and me and Rob are having a beer right back here. Let me tell you about something that happened three years ago yesterday in 2019. This same fucking thing happens. Just found out that one of my favourite bands, Bring Me The Horizon, are playing in Oklahoma tonight, which have literally just passed through. So it might be time to turn around and go and watch them. We're spinning this bitch around and headed straight back to Oklahoma. Like, we look back on that memory of the surprise Bring Me The Horizon show with such fond, fond memories, don't we? And it's literally all, like one day off three years ago, exact, that was happening. And now it's happening again. So every cloud, I guess. I guess it's just a Vegas thing of like, what look? <laughs> Seriously, what? Quick question, so, so, quick so, question. Is this our world or everyone else is just a <laughs> uh, You know what, I think I am the main character after all. What have you just got out of Freezer? Just the money, got to keep the, got to keep the cash cold, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. Can I hold the icy hot one? You can hold one. Ooh, that is an icy cold one. <laughs> look at that. You look like you're a dirty <laughs> boy, don't you? Spend some money for no reason. Buy some new trainers, please. <laughs> I'll only need a 50 for that, mate. Look at that. Hey, finish getting your teeth sorted. That's all. Sort out the dandruff. <laughs> dandruff. Do a little bit more with a little bit more. Oh, and there's still some more. Bring the horizons on in 15 minutes. Should we go into the venue? Yeah. What's interesting is this is like quite a nice casino. We're just in a Damien Hurst themed bar, but it's just full of moshers. And this is something that will be happening across the city. It's just full of moshers and it's fucking great. Here's something I've never seen before. These tickets, I went to like get them scanned in and like there's no there's no barcode. They're contactless tickets. That is so great. It's like, it's like an Apple Pay ticket. 
So it's even more secure. That's great. That's very good. Let me be absolutely 100% honest. I looked at the menu, I saw, ooh, orange juice, that, and I saw the vodka. Let's get around of vodka oranges for the boys. That's uh, not vodka orange. It is. No, it's not. Right, right, no, 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 right, no. Right, shut up for a minute. I'm a guest where she filled it up, so. Well, I mean, I, I've had a drink of that, and yeah. I, could, I didn't taste any fresh orange juice. Maybe there. There was the uh, there was so, a so dash. You, you, you honestly, know, you know when, uh, you know when you when you buy a, a vodka orange in the UK and it's like ooh, a single little shot of vodka, uh, of vodka and it's all orange. Think of. You know we've got to work the, the tomorrow, right? Around. You know we've got to do some good work tomorrow, and you're buying us a pint of vodka. Uh, that was like eighty dollars. It's fucking tiny! It's fucking standing! There's no fucker here! We, we, we joked in the in the in the Uber saying, what would be funny if we were the only three? We're not fucking far off. I haven't heard a fucking live drum. This is what being born into it is. Lowest common denominator. Like, like, we went to uh, Lollapalooza and watched Machine Gun Kelly. And I ripped a Machine Gun Kelly song. I'm not even sure. I'm pulling my nerves now. And it's called Unknown Torment. I've written the whole song, right? I didn't even know how small the meaning of this is like. Because you're not coming back. I really need your help. Yeah? P please, please help me. Oh, don't worry, bro. I've got you. Call 911. There's been a murder. Um, uh, it's, na its name is Rock and Roll. And it, and it's, Hello? Uh, Hello? It's yeah. Yeah, we need the police, the fire brigade, and the ambulance. Yeah, I just watched Landon Barker do 12 minutes of complete and utter nonsense. The most derivative shite I've ever fucking seen in my entire life. And even his acoustic guitarist for my in. Yeah, I'll hold. <laughs> Getting put in hold by emergency services. Yep, hi. Yep, hello. Oh, they've gone. Obviously, they don't respond to real emergencies, eh? That was a bad one, it. All I said was he was the shittest act I've ever seen. A man with two million followers. And he responded to my DMs. Put it back on. He responded to my DM saying he was the shittest act I've ever seen. I feel bad because he said he was trying his hardest. But if that's his hardest, then he shouldn't be there. Don't, he as really if he's him, send him one back and say, tell your guitarist not to mime next time. <laughs> Oh my god, man's, man's sitting backstage DMing me. Look, man, I've seen a lot of bands in my time. You're the shittest. Sorry you feel that way. Yeah, but yeah, I've got feelings. That, hey, that, is, that is gaslighting. I'm sorry. He's not, he's not, he's not, he's not said it. Hey. He's not sorry for his actions, he's sorry he's for sorry how you feel. feel. Guy has two drinks. He's on the shoulder lean. Man can't hack it. Man's a little buster. Buster ass bitch. God, I'm so fucked. Wake up! Grab a bush and put it on. God, that's a big nose. Push it back! Who amongst us tonight will confess? Confess? Confessed? Shut up. I, I, hi, hi, I, I, I'm Jeff Valley. Do you have a, a, a sin to confess? I mean... You know what, kill us. <laughs> Cut! Sharky. Needles. He said I'll be there when you need me to be.
and he's not ready yet, evidently. Maybe it's for the priest. <laughs> Wake up, God, bitch! Wake up, God, bastard! Confession time, bastard! He was on his phone all night. He was. And a priest we, didn't lie. We can confirm that he was on his phone all he, night. He can confirm because he, he was is. also doing it. When God, this is a dead old confession, man. This might be the deadest confession after Danny's white long prolonged shit confession. I want to confess something to you right now. Oh, yeah. God. God. Do you know what? I, I don't even want forgiveness. God, you better. Well, I'm not listening. You better be like fully. Well, it's still to do with me. Give it to my secretary. If you're not looking for forgiveness, then I'm not the guy, man. I only get involved at the forgiveness level of the escalation. My God, Jake comes to Vegas and bets against us and then confesses and says, I don't want forgiveness. What is, are you all right? Let's hurry up, confess. Hello. 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 God. Yeah, what up? I don't believe in you. However, yeah. <laughs> one thing I do want to say to you. Oh, hurry I, up. That big nose could sniff God. 20 bags straight yeah, up. No yeah, problem. You live in a very nice flat. I do. Thank it's you. lovely. Thank you, yeah, it is. I'm one, not gonna one down from top. <laughs> it's a nice flat. It's That's almost nice. a penthouse flat. Can't and there's a lot there's a few rooms in that flat. There is indeed a, a fair few rooms here. It's a nice big flat. And I stay over. You stay over often, you're always often. welcome to stay over in the penthouse. And I've stayed over a few times with friends. Oh, very unlikely. Not just one, but I've I have stayed with friends before. Yeah. I would just like to say that every single room in your flat has had me arrive in that room with some female. <laughs> That's bollocks. I don't believe that for a I, second. Well, why would I be? There's no so way. You, so how many rooms in my flat? So, so you've got so your, living, you've got, you've so got your so living room. Yeah. Yeah. You've got my room, your guest dance room, room all the way. Guest, guest bathroom, room, guest bathroom, dance room, and your but room. Why have you been arriving in guest bathroom? Well, there's a guest bathroom. Yeah. Um, what about the hallway? Does that count? Yep. Yep. What about the cupboard? Invalid confession! Does uh, it uh, 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 It's going back to bed. The world's oh, worst confession. Yep. Check back in, the in, in, in a bit. In, check back in soon when someone might Ooh, be And a man and I've arrived in a room. Jesus Christ. And it's not even true. It wishes. is true. Well, you handed it in the hallway or in the cupboard. And this will have to be edited out because, like, the side. No, it won't. Yeah, it will. Because I'm the editor. Yeah, it will. Because Sidemen did a thing about when they had to edit it out because of Revolut. Yeah, but then. Oh. <laughs> 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 Good morning and welcome to Las Vegas, Nevada. We're about to head to the Las Vegas Festival Grounds to the When We Were Young Festival. Now we tried this yesterday. <laughs> Turns out, I did buy the iPad with my winnings from Las Vegas. And we were so, so fucked that that's the last thing we filmed. We didn't bother picking up a camera again throughout the whole rest of our day in LA or during the flight or on the way back home from London because this trip was incredible, but it was so tiring. And yeah, that's where the video ends. It's not quite as cinematic as you may have expected. It actually caught me off guard in the edit, but 
That's how it went. Thanks again to Revolut for sponsoring this video. Thank you, Patreon supporters. We love you. We could not do this without you. I know that we've got sponsors and stuff, but it's the Patreon that really keeps us going. So thank you so very, very much. Uh, and I also want to extend a personal thank you just to my three fucking best mates on this trip, Raz, Varley, and Matty Bridey. I am blessed that at age 30, I'm still surrounded with like-minded people who make this shit happen every single year, and I couldn't do it without you. And, you know, I get to make a nice video for you to watch as well. So thanks, everyone. Love you, and um, we'll see you soon. We've got lots more coming, would you believe? Bye-bye. This is a tough one because everyone's drunk, but he is the priest. I'm not drunk. No? Uh -huh. No, man. I've just been praying a lot, so I'm high on praying. Yeah. <laughs> priest? It's getting that, that holy water out. <laughs> Is there anyone here that wants to confess to the Lord Jesus Christ? <laughs> Shit's confessioner of all time, Jake Valley. Yeah, I guess I'll do the job. Yep. It's me. Confession time. Right, confess. Dasis most efficient confession. He was um, he was a shit confessor. Me. Um He was a crap confessor. Alright, the awesome uh, so this is a good confession actually. Alright, kind of. Um Lord, he, Lord, are you with me? I think Lord Lord. I think he's asleep and snoring. Lord. Right. Wake, wake him up, please. You know how to wake Lord up, smack him on the back. No, 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 Lord, hurry up, man. Set up, you fucking dumb nonce. He was shit at confessions as well. Yeah, um, so here's, here's, a, here's a good confession for you, Lord. So. It better be a good confession. So there was a time at. within Sheffield. Oh, I like within Sheffield. Within the Gorgia. Yeah, 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 Sheffield's great. You know, when I made Sheffield long, long time ago, yeah, this I was like, yeah, I'm going to make this Yeah, nice. this isn't about you, Lord. You fucking idiot. So within Sheffield, when. My friend Ch <laughs> Chucky, he used to have a, a different place than what he has now. But, oh, uh, he had a but, lovely but place. Yeah, 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 it was all. That was shit, that yeah, place. Yeah, but he used to have like, this pull-out sofa bed that we used to stay on. It was, it was like That's bright true. orange. Oh, oh he's, he's still got it, actually. That's no, right. it's gone now, mate. It's, it's gone. gone. It's gone. It's been yeah. a while. Shows what friend I am. So anyway. Seems like man then doesn't go out in Sheffield Everyone anymore. shut up and listen to me. I try to fucking confess my sins, but I can't fucking get a word in endways. Can't fuck all right. Me. Just because it sounds all listening. Talk, talk about fucking God complex, it's eh? Not, it's not to do with you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway. I, I, anyway, I, I, anyway. I, I, I need to vet my priest. Anyway, anyway. So, <laughs> Lane, oh, I, I think there was a night I was. And we, 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 we all got in very drunk. And I woke up on the bed. Don't do that. That's really annoying. But who was there? But obviously careless. Oh, but yeah. but all, also also with the lady friend, a lady who, friend. Who, who's showing him nameless. But, and all I could hear, like as, not as, nameless as, as, then. All I could hear as I woke in my drunken haze was absolutely no fucking chance. Not in a million years. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. We hope you've had as much fun as we did. We'll see you soon. <laughs>